2013 Mercedes-Benz E-Class officially revealed. After tons of spy shots, teaser videos and leaked images, the 2013 Mercedes-Benz is finally revealed by the German manufacturer. The split headlamps are gone, making way for a single-unit LED-equipped headlamp cluster, which still mimics the quad headlamps. Since this is a facelift, we weren't expecting full design changes, but with whatever Merck has done, they've made the E look fresh indeed. The larger new design radiator grille adds to the look, while the rear design, like the rest of the design, hasn't changed much. You can still make out that it's an E-Class. Mercedes and luxury go hand in hand, so it would have been foolish of us to not expect them to work on the interiors, which they have, while it might not be as big a change as the front. The interior is now cleaner, especially with the centre console now without a gear shifter on it. They've used some of the technologies you'll find in the next generation S-Class. In the engines department, Mercedes has two 2 liter petrol engines, two diesels and one hybrid available. Come Detroit Motor Show and the E-Class AMG will be out as well. Two gearboxes, six-speed manual and seven-speed automatic will be available. The press release from Mercedes surprised us when it mentioned the new feature short-term M mode. This one, unlike the M dynamic mode, which you are likely to find in the products of another German manufacturer, helps increase fuel economy by switching back to the transmission to automatic. The updated E-Class looks fresher and younger than the model it replaces. We feel that it would be great for both the manufacturer and customers if the car could be brought to India in the first half of 2013.